Last Sunday there was a mega cars and coffee meet on the premises of the Museum of Fire in Penrith. The event was organised by Enthusiast Insurance with over 400 cars on display. The organisers unveiled their promotional branded vehicle, an 8.5 litre Chevy 502. This video shows the unveiling. Uh, these two gentlemen to please pull back the cover on our project vehicle. Jimmy. As they're doing that, I run through some spec on it. It does have a 502 in it, so it's it's not your average 350 or LS. It's it's quite uh, quite a bit of fun. It's got a manualized turbo 400 in it and a nine inch that's built by a castle made roadshop. It's got three nines in the back, so it's pretty punchy. The wheels. Uh, <laughs> We quickly figured out when we tried to order off the shelf wheels that this car was not up for that. So there are a set of custom two piece wheels that we're designing at the moment. Along with other things like a front end update, we will be removing all of the stock stuff and replacing it with some cool stuff. We're looking at even working with some local carbon manufacturers to build some interesting parts for it. So you have to tell us something about your pride and joy? Yeah, yeah. so it started as just an idea in a meeting one day and uh, People were throwing around ideas how to get our tent and whatnot to events and yeah. somebody suggested a Ford Transit on a lease and I quickly joined that meeting and jumped on that. <laughs> and decided for, for reasons, what personal reasons? Just for cool factor really. Yeah, like yeah. we're an insurance company that covers modified cars, collector cars, vintage cars. Why not join the crowd? Good. We all Good. are very Good. involved in the aftermarket community, so now we get to throw all our ideas at one vehicle that we can actually use. Tell us, so it's a 502? It is, yeah. yeah. So That's it's pretty big motor. It's yeah. pretty It's pretty healthy. It's also very thirsty. Yeah. So yeah. I, I would never be the kind of person to judge someone on fuel economy, but it is it is very, very thirsty. So you're you, 98, 95? It runs 98, yep. yeah. We are looking at doing a few upgrades to it already. So mostly on the fueling and the head side of things, so we can run E85. Right. So that'll be fun. It's also always fun to try and find E85. It's very snappy for mm. such a large motor. It's, it's roughly eight and a half litres by modern terms. Yes. So it's it's you'd expect it to be a bit slow, a bit lethargic, but it's it's very light on its heels, so to speak. Yeah. Naturally aspirated, yep. It's running about 10.5 to one compression. So yeah. nothing out of control, but definitely a lot more than stock. Right, and gear, gearbox? The gearbox is a manualized turbo 400. It's a reverse pattern. So we've got a B&M shifter on it to pound through the gears. So that, mm -hmm. that keeps you busy. It's definitely not a car you drive with a coffee in your hand. And more to come into the stable by the time. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So this is, uh, this is the first one. So we've got quite a bit of work to do to it still, which is great. We get to get the whole team involved and uh -huh. we'll start to involve the community on uh, ideas or thoughts on things as well. Sure, sure. So that'd be great engagement to keep on, on all of our clients on board and in communications with us. Yeah. And then as we move forward, we'll start looking at other vehicles for Queensland, Victoria, Perth, South Australia, right. where we have people based that are handling the insurance duties day to day. So are they agencies or part of the business? They're all part of our business. Right. Yeah. yeah. So we've got uh, 32, 33 different people getting the job done itself. And then you have people like me who get to enjoy the fruits of those labor and spend it on branding and marketing and making right. sure everybody knows who we are. Just a massive thanks to everybody for coming out and yourself for having a few minutes to talk to us. Fantastic. Nice to meet you, Brett. Too easy, mate. Thank you.